Skippy, um, Boxing Day defeat here at Watford. What was your assessment of the team's performance out there? Um, I feel like we dominated most of the game in possession-wise, but just at times I think it was that final pass or switching off a couple of times on the counter-attack and against a team that is looking for this. We needed to be more switched on, I think, but we'll learn from this. Um, we'll analyse it and we'll look to put it right. Quick turnaround again, so we'll we'll be looking to put it right in the next game against QPR. Yeah, with, with that final pass and final finish missing today, what, what do you put that down to? Because the team have been on form in the final third quite a lot this season. Um, I don't know, just I think a couple of times, maybe taking that extra touch, maybe when we didn't need to. But I think it was all players, I think, not just the attackers, even the defenders maybe not moving the ball as quick as we could have at times. Um, so no, um, just I think one of those days where we didn't quite click in the final third and then to concede on a counter, sloppy from us. But I'm sure you can't really fault how the team sort of kept going until the end when you think of a couple of the moments at the end, Mario's ball into Timu. Um, a great challenge from their defender. So you, you can't fault with the team's character um, to go to the end. No, I mean, you don't be in the position that we're in without the character in the group. Um, it's hard to say that at the moment, but we're, we're as a group, we'll be ready to, to put that back and make sure that we're right for, for the next game. Um, I mean, I don't think we need to get too down. I'm disappointed today. Um, we would have liked to put some a Christmas smile on people's faces but we weren't able to do that today and I think we'll look and analyse it and see there's definitely room for improvement for that. Yeah. But looking at some of the positives to take, obviously today we saw Ben Gibson come on back from injury, obviously uh, Kieran Dow back as well, lots of players coming back from injury and you consider the difficulties that have been going on over recent weeks in terms of the amount of players that we've had missing, that's only a positive moving forward that we've got so many players coming back now. Definitely. Um, it's nice to get those body back, bodies back. Um, it provides competition for the group. Um, means that if you're not right in training, that there's people waiting to, to take your place. So, no, it's a massive positive for the group. And hopefully moving forward, there'll be more people returning. Um, so, no, it means that we have to fight for our place. Just, just looking ahead, obviously, you said there's quite a quick turnaround when you got, I think you've got QPR coming up and then Barnsley on the 2nd of January. So I suppose after a defeat um, in the Championship, you've got a, only a couple of days to sort of turn things around. So that's a positive to look at. Definitely. Um, I think that that helps us that we haven't got too long to, to go over the performance. Of course, we need to look at and see what we needed to do better in that game. Um, we'll do that tomorrow. Um, but it's a quick turnaround, which is good as a, as a player. It means don't dwell on it too long and we can put it right on Tuesday. And the team's still in a great position when you look at the overall league table. So. No, we can't be too down on ourselves. Um, of course, we would have loved to put a big gap between one of our rivals today, but it was a difficult game. They've got a new manager, but no excuses from us. We'll learn from that and we'll be ready to put it right on Tuesday.